Hey everyone, my name is Olaf, and today I'll talk about the next update of Blender, which is Blender 2.8, and why it's a huge step forward for rendering simulations in Blender. As you can see, this is rendered in the uh, real-time rendering engine called Eevee, and it looks just as great as it did in Cycles. You can actually download Blender 2.8 at the uh, Blender website, but it's not the official version, so you have to use an experimental version. So. Uh, download it and uh, this is not really a tutorial but I will show you how simulations work in Eevee. So when it comes to the materials we use the same materials you can use the principled uh, shader, you can use the glossy shader, you can use the glass shader and you can use the diffuse shader as well. And even though it's a real-time render engine it looks just as great if not better than it did in cycles and it just takes a fraction of the time. And uh, we add environment textures or uh, background images just as easily as we did in cycles so uh, that works the same and um, when it comes to rendering images you just go up to render and just click render image so that works the same as in uh, cycles as well so as you can see there are a lot of similarities between the cycles render engine and the uh, EV render engine the animation settings in Eevee are also very similar to the animation settings in Cycles. You just select the output folder, then you select the file type, and then you choose how many samples you want for the animation, which will increase the quality of the uh, rendering. And then you just go up to Render, and then click uh, Render Animation. So uh, because this is a real-time render engine, it's uh, going to be very quick. And because the rendering is so quick, it frees up a lot of time for us to, uh, for example, increase the resolution of our uh, fluid simulations so that the fluid simulations look even better. So the conclusion of this video is that EV is very simple to use if you know cycles already and that the simulations will look a lot better and have a lot less rendering time than they did in cycles. So make sure to subscribe for future EV tutorials when uh, Blender 2.8 comes out in October. Thanks for watching.